Ready? Yeah. made for a big time moment, so I love that. But it was a bunch of friends that just grew up playing basketball and said, hey, let's go over here and start our own thing. And so much of it justified so much that we were doing. We didn't have to go find new transfers. We didn't have to go to a different school. We didn't have to hold AD back so he would be cold in high school. Right. We didn't have to do none of that. We did it our way. That championship justified not just basketball, it justified a lifestyle and a way to approach basketball with a good perspective. And that's why I think, you know, the, the in, in my mind, the right team won. Marcus, pretty much considered two top players in that area. Mm -hmm. We know each other since birth. Like that's that's one of my brothers. I feel like a lot of people like try to create this feud between us. Like we're we're like fighters or something. Like that's like one of my best friends. Like we've always been cool. But like on the court, it's always about we always talking, talking funny stuff on the court. But it's never been nothing uh, like crazy that sort. But uh, 
we definitely make each other better knowing us too. We're the top players in the state. Uh, people know it, so we, we make each other better by not even like, because we, like from, we've been to the same middle school together. Uh, elementary, we had summer schools together and all that. We worked out. High school, we were best friends. High school came. I mean, we kept the same relationship, but like we couldn't hang out as much just because he was in a whole other part of town going to school and I was on this side. So, I mean, but we've always been close and all that. <laughs> So now, he don't know what you're doing, but if you don't sell, if you don't do a good job of selling, if you're doing three moves, A, B, C, you gotta sell what? B to C. You still gotta do B. You still gotta do your, you still gotta do your little jazz step because you gotta show why you sold. What's the scouting report? You guys know what the scouting report is? You seen the scouting report? You, you probably ain't seen one. I'm in high school shit. They don't, they really don't break it down. In college, it's gonna say, it's gonna say Aaron Demos, super quick. To hit the wide open three. Has good pace, pushing the ball with the court. A little small, we can post him. We can put him in the post. That's, that's what they're gonna break you down. Or they're gonna be like super strong, super quick, and shoot up the dribble with the hours that you buy him. He likes to score. He doesn't like throwing the ball though. Coming up. Definitely like a mentor because I worked out with him. I worked out with him a bunch of times. Uh, before this AAU season, uh, we worked out like three times right before we left for our first session at Jeff. And uh, like you said, I remember looking at him as a basketball, uh, basketball trainer. He was just like a mentor, like, told me, like, I was his favorite point guard. Uh, he's like, nobody can guard. Just always just putting positive stuff in my ear, thinking, uh, it's making me think that I'm the best and uh, all this. And I, t I was texting my dad the whole time. I, I was crying. It was because I was, I was. I was just with him. Uh, you was with me too. Uh, right before school had started last week, worked out three days straight, and I heard that, and I, I was sick to my stomach. <laughs> It was just, I mean, there's really not words that can't explain it. I mean, I did the ugly cry. <laughs> After we won, I had the ugly cry. All my makeup was gone and the pictures were horrible. I didn't care. I was extremely proud. Extremely proud. And there were, there were just no words. There were just tears. <laughs> yes. I knew he was going to be different at that point too. That this this kid, he's got it. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. When you talk about being older than uh, old beyond his years, absolutely. Oh, what happened? At least four. That's, it wasn't that's dudes. Oh, oh what? Girls. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> I got witnesses. It was. Nah, you're right. That was, that was a good it was story. like seven or eight all around and just I wanna sign it, I wanna sign it. Yes, yeah, good story. I couldn't leave that out. Uh, <laughs> all right, y'all got this. <laughs> First off, I knew they was they was a good school because I obviously saw their schedule and who they played. Uh, winning program made the tournament. All their coaches are super cool. They're not like coaches that are like uh, really like persuading you to go to their school. They're like normal, cool people. That's just like we want you. And then they'll talk about stuff just outside of basketball just to get that personal connection with you. And that's what I uh, liked about them a lot.